Oh, all right. Welcome back to the Power Talk Show with me, Dominic. We are continuing the conversation on living beyond the moment or beyond the moment. And there, I can see quite a number of co of comments uh, coming in on our Facebook page, which I'm encouraging you to go our Facebook page, Y254 channel, and post your comments, suggestions, or opinions. And I'm going to be reading them out in a bit. The first comment I have seen right now is from uh, Tom Rafiki wa Chelsea. Nico County 001, my youth men, hawataki kuchoka, wanataka vitu chip. Thank you so much, Tom, Tom Rafiki wa Chelsea. I hope you're not, I hope you're not gambling for, Chel for Chelsea, okay? Uh, Josephat Musioka boy. Yeah, this man is always watching and I love it. Uh, wow, here's another Wednesday. The show is amazing. Nico Ndani nikiwa Konza City. My number one show, Sijui ni semenini, leo si semikitu. Josephat, thank you for always watching. I'm also your number one fan. You're the best. Keep lagat, Jafan. Chelegem You know, keep lagat. You're also one of my biggest fans, and I love it. Jineko ya tatu. Chelem, chelege, chelegem geng. Eisero. Jina serious, man. Kutoka Eisero Village, Kavisaga Ward, Nandi County. Lakini kwa sasa niko na mawindo hapa Elgon View Estate. Eldoret, watching live kama kawaida. Dania Shabik, wanipate kwa, eh, hey, kuna namba hapo, watu wako single. Keep like that, anata kuhapo. Eh, Ronald Kinyua Movi, Kimbibi Mwea, watching. Thank you so much. Then we have Sally Kyle, good friend. Hello, hey there, Dominic, great show there. In my thinking, the young people have lost morals. We want easy life, easy money, good li lifestyle. I like Angela's attitude, and at least I can see that I'm not the only one who has chosen to be different to what the site is offering. I'm positive that in being unique, then I'll be able to achieve my dream, even if it's five years to come. I have chosen to start small, invest in different things, pursue in, uh, my education. In this, I'll not be in any competitive lifestyles. Rather, I'll be on my lane, moving on my speed, and above all, God's speed. Amazing. Thank you so much, Sally, for that. Please keep the comments coming on our Facebook page uh, at Y254, and I'm going to read them out in a bit. Do, do, you, do you like riddles? <laughs> Before we ask, before we ask the audience to ask a few questions, do you like riddles? I'm going to ask you some riddles. <laughs> All right? Okay. Uh, I, I don't know if you like riddles. I've got a riddle here. Mm -hmm. An elephant with one ear. An elephant with one ear? An elephant with one ear. These are Kikuyu riddles. I found some Kikuyu riddles. Okay. In five, four. Clueless. Three. Two. 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 <laughs> a cup. It's a cup. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> okay. Another one. one. Another uh, one. Uh, a house without a door. Or an a window. Egg. Ah. Too, ah. too simple. That's, too simple. I have a friend who stays between two swords but never gets cut. Teeth. The tongue. tongue. The tongue. I got uh, it. I was in the right yes, direction. Yes. Yeah. I'm I've gonna a few more. They're so nice. <laughs> I'll be asking you more. But now I'm gonna ask. Uh, today we have only a few, a few, a few number of uh, audience members. Uh, we've got uh, five from Nibs. We're gonna make a matter on traffic. Like in show in the layer. Now, f who has the mic? All right. Ask your question or your comment or suggestion. Let's go. My name is Samuel Jugona. And uh, maybe about the living the moment, we as the uh, some of the youth out there, maybe we are uh, we fear to fail. I'm there like, what will they say after I have failed? So um, I just want to use the shortcut so mm. that I can succeed in life. Perfect. Okay. Uh -huh. Pass. Uh -huh. Thank you so much, Samuel, for that. Uh, my name is Nicholas Kioko. Nicholas Kioko. Mine is just an opinion which I would like Madam there to challenge me. Uh, I feel uh, the youths uh, are engaging themselves in drugs maybe to feel good. That is maybe w w those are affected by maybe depression and also social anxiety. So they're watching, they're doing drugs in order to survive? Yeah, to feel okay. good. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. I will challenge that. Mm. Okay, my name is Irene Morugi. Irene. Okay, I wanted to say this. Some youths are engaging in some bad behaviors or they want things so fast because for example in some jobs they want people who are more experienced for example they say a person with six years experience five years experience and you've just graduated yes and mm -hmm. you have just graduated so you wonder where will you go for those six years you go for an interview and then you miss it because of the experience mm, part of mm, it mm. so some of them are getting so depressed about the jobs they go there those who have stayed for like 20 years 10 years without jobs yeah so they are given jobs fast mm, so mm. they make them engage in things that are not good because of that and they want things fast because of that 
Perfect. Thank, thank you so you. much, Irene. Thank you. But you, you want to say something yourselves? You're good. All right. Thank you so much. Now, the, yeah, she. No, I think she's okay. good. She's good. Now, there is, there is this uh, Nicola's uh, statement, huh? mm. uh, and he is saying that many young people are just doing drugs to feel good. And I also think that in addition, many young people are uh, doing drugs just to get by. Just to survive. Just to survive. Like they, they feel that life is so harsh that if I smoke and I feel high for a bit, I just feel good because I am constantly feeling bad. What do you think? I disagree. Because life has always, everybody goes through that stage where everything seems impossible. I mean, really, for you, high school was fun. Did you, how was your high school? Uh, unfortunately, it was fun, yeah. Oh, okay. We, let me tell you something. We actually used to report, some of us used to, sp to report high school earlier. Just What's to go and have fun there. What schools were these? Yeah. Um, so uh, group of schools? No, no. <laughs> <laughs> but I mean, you know, growing up, uh. teenage is, an e is, a, is, a, is, a, is a moment of angst. You're confused. You don't know where you fit in. You don't know where you're going. Um, some people know from the time they're in class three what they want to be. Others get to campus and they still don't know what they want to do. So I don't think anyone ever has it easy. So if we say we're just, I mean, I'm sorry, weed has been, people have been smoking weed from forever. Mm. So they're also trying to just feel good. The youth may be feeling that this is new. It's not. It has been here. It's been there. It's been there throughout. But I like, I mean, I think what they need to think about is they have more, there's, you have to find you and decide who you are. Because let me tell you, there is, as far as I'm concerned, the universe has abundance. There is more than enough for everyone. Our problem is I want to be you. I'm trying to be you. That's the problem. I need to find out who I am and what I am good at and shine at that. Then there are really no problems. They have so much more opportunities, I think, compared to us guys growing up. So this technology has been a bane. You know, it's a blessing in one way, it's a challenge in mm, another. Mm. But it has opened so many things. Knowledge flows. These days, Google is your best friend. You can acquire skills from nowhere. These guys, you can use your art and your talent to shine. Ask guys, Maze, you'd say you want to be a musician. Whose child? To do what? My How? DJ. Where? Mm. D what? Mm -hmm, yes. You know? And now you're seeing the big names, kina, you know, are making crazy money, mm -hmm. you know? But w what about Irene's uh, perspective? That look, uh, uh, the reason sometimes we want to go for shortcuts, because the world has, is putting unrealistic demands on us. Like, how do I have two, three, four, five, six years of experience? And I'm freshly and I'm graduated. graduated. And I can go a shortcut and give maybe 5,000, 10,000, or even have sex and get the job. But how long will it last? The horizontal promotions, how far will you get with them? Well, but what are the I'll repercussions as well? Now, let me job. tell Irene, uh -huh. here's the other irony. Um, even for us looking for jobs now, they'll tell you, we look for one for somebody with 10 years experience, but what they're offering to pay is another of telling you, see, apply. Am I making sense? Mm -hmm. So it's, it's a conundrum. So we have to find ourselves. But who says you have to all get employed? For, for, I mean, like, if you think about it, some of the biggest skills these days are the hands. You know where you have to get your hands dirty? Farming technical skills, people make crazy money. But us guys, everybody, not everybody has to be a lawyer, doctor, teacher, lawyer again. Yeah, <laughs> You don't have to. Find you, your you've, space. You've, you've put yourself on the spot right there. You re do realize that? No, because what? I was a lawyer and I moved into this. No, no, no. You said nobody, not everybody has to become a lawyer and all that. Yeah, a doctor mm. or a teacher. Mm. Be mm. you. But let's say, no, let's, let's, okay, I understand, I understand what you're saying, and I, 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 I respect that and I agree with it. However. But, however, yes, yes, that is my, my, my part. Not everybody can be an entrepreneur or has the opportunity right now to be an entrepreneur. That is true, because I'd be terrible at business. I'm, I'm work. Okay. I'm, I'm, that's not my, that's not my forte. See, true. Now, uh -huh. But now, I want to get into this job, right? Mm -hmm. The opportunity is there. We have a competition of uh, maybe a job of 40,000 people has, I mean, 40,000 shillings has a competition of 1,000 plus, 2,000 mm. people, right? Mm. The only thing I need, the shortcut that I need is to give somebody, to give some money or to, uh, to go horizontal, if, as you said, to sleep with the... But you think you're the only one doing that? Yeah. W think of it that way. We are many, but it's... But... You're trying to get in there. But and someone who is in there who has been employed for two, three years tells you, Yeah, maybe in Lipia and Kwani Kitu Nisabuni Taisha. Yeah, you keep me talking scare your statement. I yeah, know it's used all the that time. Was I, I know, yeah. but you need to think about it. Akwanza in this digital age, Hakuna Siri, Dadang, Akuna. So anything you do now will come to light later. Suddenly you become pastor, you become this great leader. X files are being unleashed of mm -hmm, you. Mm -hmm. Can you live with it? 
Unfortunately. That's the thing, you know, as I say, every action has a consequence. So think it through. And I like what the, was she called? Sally, one of your last on your yeah, social media. media. Yeah, we said, yeah. yes, you need to find who you are and be you. Define you. Because as a shortcut. Imagine utalipa, majuto mjuku. Eh, shortcut ndiyo lihongana elfu kumi. Na extent ambuwa sawa, hai kutosha ongeza. Or now from now on sawa, your salo half of it belongs to me. Where are you going with that? You're a, you're a slave for the rest of your life. So when will you say enough is enough? That's how we keep exploiting and misusing each other. So what will you say to those people who are encouraging young people to do that? Like, uh, let's say, look at some of the music that has been released recently. Yeah? This guy should be... <coughs> Yes, if that come near me, Viboko. Mm -hmm. ah, la, 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 la. No, look at the, some of the music that they Let's are, not they even watching. talk about it. Even some of... Uh, we, we won't say where. But we can talk about like the music from uh, recently, Lamba Something, that was mentioned there. Oh, yeah. And this is a song that teenagers are going to hear. And they're going to see these, the, these, the people singing these songs. They're driving big cars. They have the beautiful ladies and all that. But what, you see, what, these guys what, have what discovered they're people? hungry mm -hmm. and they're taking advantage because... You know you can sing decent songs and still sing the same thing. I'll give you Marvin Gaye, Sexual Healing. Yes. Okay, the beginning it was taboo. Mm. Even here it couldn't be played I hear those years. Mm -hmm. But there are songs that can be sung. I mean, let me let me keep it local. Saudi Soul, Nishike, there's controversy, but it's a decent song. Mm -hmm. Or Sanaz Mfalm Mapenzi. Some nansa my drinks na my yangs ju na nini jamen. Huh? These guys have discovered the young people will rukia, ruk ruk yes, but where is it going? Do you know there's a song called Duda? Kai Jehovah. It's okay. <laughs> Zambele as well. <laughs> I mean, we've sung everything, but when you think about it, mm -hmm. I call it chewing gum music. But that's for want of a better classification. Because it hits like this, yes, for a month or two, but it's not a classic. It's not something that will last. You'll sing Saudi soul songs. Me and know them from the first songs, Kina Asubui, which these guys may not even know. But they started early. You know, you think of Kenyans who do really good talent. So, shine. Don't sing something because it's, like I said, chewing gum. You know, chewing gum is very exciting when you see it the first time you chew it. In a potes alado in a tupa. So, those guys come with one hit wonders. Ama? I hear you. Exactly. So, really, where is it going? Where is it going? How long will they shine? Look at the guys who are durable and sustainable and have continued. There are people who bring in things that are classics. Kina Ed Sheeran. You know? Timeless music. Yes. You sit down and put your talent to the best that it can be. And you shine and you thrive, you know. Kinafai, she knows she's my namesake, so I have to talk about her. <laughs> people who do good work. So you I need to think about it. Okay. Uh. There'll always be people. I mean, our generation was Manyake. Horrible song. Horrible. Horrible. Oh, sizes. I, do you even remember? Yes. Please. Terrible <laughs> songs. And me, what, what coolers me is the girls are dancing. And these guys are saying horrible things about women. And the chick is... So do you see, do you, now, uh, now that but you see, it, it didn't start Jana, it's been there. People have to think. Because in the long term, when you start chilling out, what kind of music do you really enjoy? But women are being told that, me, that dancing to those songs, in the way those songs require, is empowerment, is showing ah. that you are free. Who said what? That it's your rules, your life, your rules. My life, my rules, yes. by me doing what? By gyrating. Actually, yeah, by gyrating. I mean, I'm, I'm next to nothing and you're in a full suit. Uh -huh. The girls need to wake up and look. Uh, but they're being told, show your body, be proud of your body as, you know, show your pieces of hey, flesh. Hey, you know what? There's more, more, flesh, to, more freedom. You're not your boobs and you're not your ass. What matters is what's in here and what's in here. And the more, and the more, and it's changing. I'm seeing girls becoming more aware. You have a few lost ones, but you know, unfortunately, bad news um, spreads faster than good news. Mm, I hear you. Yeah, not every female is thick like that. But... Some of the strongest feminist movements are the ones who are encouraging some of the girls to, to be this way. No, there's a thing about being proud about who you are because definitely, I mean, like the five fingers in this hand will never be all the same size. So there's no point of making everybody think that a, a 1GB is the best size to look. Even big girls are cool. But they're not talking about them bearing everything. Ah, uh, no, let me, let me. Which let, one, Ebu? Let me, there are some, especially uh, if uh, some, some of the personalities in movies where they have had to act naked in some of the movies, they come out and say, after I acted naked, I felt so empowered. Because she's feeling there's a gap. Because there are females who are known, and they're well known in Hollywood or whatever, mm -hmm. who tell you, I'm sorry, I'm not doing that. And we're getting to there. If you think about the Me Too movement, mm -hmm. it brought to light how all this, you know, couch casting happens. People mm -hmm. tell you, you must do, mm -hmm. you must do. But mm -hmm. people are lying to say, no, see lazima to do. See lazima to do. Yeah, see lazima. Mm -hmm. Now, as we finish up, what would you tell young people in this instance, therefore, in terms of resilience, in terms of living beyond the moment, what are some of two, three things you'd, you'd, you'd advise? 
I'll tell them you have a great future ahead of you. You have the potential and the capacity to do anything under the sun only if you choose to excel because there can only be one you. And this world is humongous. Opportunities are amazing and there are many. Look at being the best that you can. But at the same time, one, love, respect yourself. That way, there are things you'll never do. <clears throat> in the world of social media, if you don't want to, if you never get involved in stuff that you don't want your mother, your grandmother, or your children to ever see, don't post stuff like that because digital, digital footprints cannot be erased. But everything is possible right now. Believe in yourself, you're in the right place, and seek knowledge. Knowledge is key, knowledge is power. You have, I don't know, you have cut blanche. You can be anything you want to be. But also respect people. Everything takes time. The walls of Jericho, it took seven days for guys to walk around them. It was, you know, they had God on their side. You could have just said, down. But no, they had to learn resilience. A baby takes nine months to grow. Even if you become a good musician, you have to practice. So find your skills, find what you're good at doing, and do it. That's it. There's some more comments here. Lack of opportunities are forcing young youth to opt for shortcuts. Budia Kelvin. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, I think uh, the other comments, we, we have read them out uh, from, yes, I think we have read those ones. Ah, just for Musioka, those riddles <laughs> no. were so easy. <laughs> Salimia Nicholas Giogo and the others. Now, good night. Lala Mzuri. Uh, just for you are saying that it was were, were easy? Okay. Oh, no. Let's do this. No. I have gone round the forest with a red motorcycle. I have gone round the forest with a red motorcycle. A forest fire. <laughs> a rainbow. That's not red. It has many colors. In, in the traditional language, rainbow. they do not know there are many colors. It is called a rainbow. Hey, they, they only see the top color, which is I have red. had with you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I have traveled with one who never tells me to rest. A shadow. People here are very corrupt. <laughs> I'm going to stop with a very <laughs> difficult one. Really difficult. They face up as if they are about to lead a song. Tan, tan, five. Four, a drum. Three. No. <clears throat> three. Two. <laughs> <laughs> who faces up? The horns of kettle. Yeah. Bonus for sana. Amen. Angela Muhaki has been on my show. Media personality, community leader, a lawyer, a me certified mediator. She has done everything and she is reminding you and I to learn to live beyond the moment. And uh, as we finish up the show, I want to remind you, all of you, that as she has mentioned, uh, you've got a great future in you and there is much hope in you. And uh, shortcuts, as she said, there is always karma. Sometimes it comes back to bite and bite hard. Uh, as you, when you are young, you don't see it, uh, but one day when you have a son and you have to sit him down and tell him not to have to follow a shortcut, you just have to remember that you followed those shortcuts and it, it's going to be difficult for you to be authentic and real. Thank you for watching the Power Talk Show. I wish you the very, very best and uh, uh, we're going to see you next Wednesday. Be mad, be exceptional, make a difference. See ya. <laughs>